Hallelujah. Yeah. Where we can become born again of the Holy Spirit. We need to be born again of the Holy Spirit, love. Born again of the Holy Ghost. Born again of the Holy Spirit, sister. Born again of Jesus. God bless you. God bless you. Have a good evening. Have a good evening. So we become born again of the Holy Spirit. Where the Spirit of God comes in and gives us a new nature. So we don't have to get drunk. We don't have to take drugs. We don't have to be materialistic, seeking money, 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 money. Me, 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 me. No, we become born again and God changes us from the inside. Amen. That's what he wants to do for us today. But it starts by faith in Jesus. Not faith in the drink. Not faith in the drugs. Not faith in the sex. Amen. But faith in Jesus. Faith in the Lord Jesus. And when you have faith in the Lord Jesus, He sets you free. When you have faith in the Lord Jesus, He pours into your life His love. When you have faith in the Lord Jesus, He gives you a new life, a new peace, a new joy, a new hope, a new life. All in Jesus Christ. If you trust Him as your Lord and Savior. He offers that to you today. He says, come to me, all you who are weak and devilated, and I will give you rest. He promises you that if you go to Him, He will give you peace of mind. And He will. I've taken funerals, and when I've taken those funerals and I've read the Bible, it's given people peace. Amen. Do you remember those words? The Lord Amen. is my shepherd. Amen. I shall not want. Those words mean something. They will give you peace if you trust them. He offers you peace. He offers you His love and mercy and grace today. Amen. Remember, you can save your pension so you're blue in your face, it will not save you on your deathbed. Amen. No matter how big your pension is, Amen. no matter how Praise big your Lord. pension pot is, God. it will not save Praise you God. on your deathbed. Praise the Lord. But what will save you is Jesus Christ, Amen. who Amen. said in that old hymn, when I survey the wondrous cross Amen. on which the Prince of Glory died. Amen. The Prince of Glory came down and shed his blood and died on that cross and shed his blood for you on that cross. Amen. And when he shed his blood, he died as a savior. And he invites you to eternal life. He invites you to eternal life, to be forgiven, to have a new life, to be restored in the blood of Jesus Christ. Amen. To have a new life, a new hope, and a new future, a new purpose. Oh, God is good. God Amen. is merciful. God is kind. Amen. God is loving. Yes. And God wants to save you today. Yes, he, does. he wants to save you. And all you have to do is have faith in Him. And when you have faith in Him, He will forgive you. He will restore you. Amen. And you will know His love in your life. You will know His joy in your life. Amen. And peace in your life. Yes. He offers you His love. Amen. But you have to take it by faith. Yes. Take it by faith. And as you take it by faith, it will forgive you, He will cleanse you, and He will restore you. But you've got to have faith in Him. And repent of the old life. Turn away from the old life. Turn away from that which is wrong. Do not lie, do not steal, do not commit adultery. Do not have any other gods. Do not use the name of God's name in vain. You don't need to swear. You don't need to swear. You don't need to curse the name of God. It is a sin to curse the name of God. And to use Jesus' name as a curse word, it is a sin. Amen. But He died for your sin. He died on that cross and shed His blood. And His shedding of blood will wash you. His shedding of His blood will cleanse you. The shedding of His blood will give you a new life. Where you will be a new creature in Christ. Will you be a new person in Christ, a new life, a new hope, and a new vision? All free, all free for you today. But you've got to grasp it by faith. You've got to cry out by faith. You've got to hear the call of Jesus in your life. Come to me. Come to me. All you who are weak and heavy laden, and I will give you rest. And you come to him by faith. Come to me. All you who are weak and heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Come to me. And if you go to him, he will give you rest. You can go to him today, and he'll give you rest. He'll forgive you. He'll cleanse you. He'll clean you up. And he'll give you a new life, a new nature, a new purpose. The old has passed away, Amen. and behold, all things become new. Amen. Because you become born again of the Holy Ghost.
Born again of the Holy Spirit. Born again of God in your life. God has come in. God has given you a new life. God has changed you. God has come to give you a new purpose and a new life. So come to God today. Come out of the drugs. Come out of the sex. Come out of the porn. Come out of it and come to Jesus today. 